Do you kids like to use the worldwide interweb? The internet? We do. We know what it is. Well, there was an item published on the internet. Marketing Tech Blog. Woo! I kept that intro short. How's everybody going? We're good. good. We're good. Punchy. I was at a blend last night. Yeah. Whoop, whoop. Yep. So I'm recovering today. <laughs> Um, have you guys been there? It's three o'clock in the afternoon, Doug. <laughs> have you guys been there? <laughs> no, we no. haven't gone up there yet. Uh, you need to mm-hmm. blend cigar bar. Oh yep. my god, it's absolutely fantastic. Absolutely. Um, so what I wanted to do was I wanted to talk about a lot of people. Uh, you know, even even if you're a traditional business out there and you're and you're talking about you know we're talking about mobile. Well, you're way out there with this mobile technology stuff. Um, and it probably doesn't have anything to do with my business, right? right. Well, you already went through some of the stats, but what I right. wanted to kind of do was go through all of the different ways that we, the general public, are interacting mm-hmm. right now with mobile devices. Um, so, uh, and and you're going to be surprised at how many different ways when you stop to think about them. So, we have click to call, right? Click yep. to call technologies is basically you put a button on your website, someone clicks it, yep. it dials the phone for them. So, you just make it easy for them to, to call you. Um, of course, SMS text messaging mm-hmm. um, is, is huge, especially with younger audience. Mm-hmm. Um, but it's, you know, it's becoming more and more now that you interact with people. So, um, Digital Home Info is a, a friend of mine, Adam Small, runs. Right. And he's got um, SMS, uh, you know, the uh, mobile tours. So you're standing in front of a house, a real, and it says, hey, text this number to this number. Mm-hmm. You text the number, guess what comes back? A link with a tour of the inside of the house. That's beautiful. Yeah. So the person doesn't, and guess what happens at the same time? It contacts the real estate agent and says, hey, someone's standing outside of this house. You know what they should need? They should develop these kind of roaming GPS connections that the same thing. So if we're close to you, Doug, yeah. there should be a text link that comes. Find out more oh, about that'd me. be interesting. Well, <laughs> we're going to talk about that. I'm going to actually going to talk a little bit about that. Awesome. Um, so uh, and then and then text messaging is climbing into other stuff like mm-hmm. now with Twitter and Facebook and uh, and e-commerce email. Yeah. Right. Text to subscribe. You guys can do it right now. If you want to test, you can text marketing yep. to 71813 and you'll be subscribed to my email. I mean, that's 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 how mm. crazy this stuff is. Um, mobile video. Half of all video now on the internet is viewed on mobile devices. Mm. That's incredible. When you think about that, because because I have Apple TV and I watch videos yep. at home on the big screen. Yep. Half of them are being viewed on the small screen. That's crazy. So um, mobile applications, of course, have have taken off um, mobile web applications. And the difference is a mobile application, someone downloads the app Mm -hmm. or purchases it. But a mobile web app is they bring up your website. But you've got an application basically running in that web browser. Yep. Um, mobile games are enormous. I met a developer last night uh, that that works on mobile games. Um, And they have ads uh, that do very well in the games and then they have in-app purchases, you know? So yep. I have this one game, it's like a sniper game. And if I want a new scope on my rifle, it's 99 cents oh my or gosh. I want this or I want that, you know, my kids keep on trying. To yeah. Do <laughs> yeah. Um, what are these transactions? Oh, we had to have more sugar yeah. punching things. Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. So, Go uh, mobile search, uh, voice search, you know, yep. so Siri and, oh, and everything else yep. is taken off. Uh, mobile commerce, you talked about that already. Mm-hmm. Mobile showrooming, you talked about that. So people go into a store and as they're standing in front of the desktop <laughs> that they might buy, right. what are they doing? They're on their mobile device looking at how much is this at the store next door. Yeah. Um, uh, it's crazy. The second screen, you talked about that. The second screen, of course, is you're watching TV and, and sitting there with your mobile device or tablet. Yeah. Um, responsive web design, we cannot say enough. No, especially Pe- right now. Yeah, people are viewing your website from a mobile device. And, and the stats that we see um, on our largest clients is continued growth there. It is not. Right. It's not plateauing. It's literally, you know, it was 10%, then 20, then 30. Now we're seeing mm-hmm. some of our clients have 40, 45% of all their web traffic yep. is coming from we're a starting, mobile yeah, device. We're starting to see a couple crests over the 50% mark. Yeah. I never thought it would go there. Yeah. I really didn't. Absolutely. Um, mobile email. Ah, 
this is one that yeah. really gets to me. But um, I, you know, the same thing, the same frustration that you hit with a website, mm-hmm. you hit it with mobile email. It's over half of all email now is filtered through. You know, someone sits on their mobile device and then they go back to their <laughs> desktop and read the rest. That's very important. And, yeah. And so the thing is, is if you have this terribly, uh, I'm going to make a shout out to somebody, Indiana Sports Corps. Yeah. I love them. But they don't have a mobile responsive really? email, and it's really irritating <laughs> to me because I can't pinch and zoom and do all of that stuff on it. Get it? It's easy. The mm-hmm. templates are out there for free. Absolutely. Um, of course, call a professional too if you if you need the help. <laughs> um, uh, social media and mobile. Uh, the majority of people's interactions on Facebook, yeah. on Twitter, are are happening that way now with integrated video integrated camera um camera interactions with instagram uh meerkat you might have heard oh, of. Yeah, yeah, yeah meerkat is live videos on twitter uh periscope is another one that popped up mm-hmm. <laughs> get that uh <laughs> per- <laughs> i know that was bad oh, my. uh periscope basically is kind of like meerkat except it'll record it too right so now you can take it and throw it on youtube or whatever yep um and that's becoming uh Map and location awareness. Oh, my god! You guys gosh. don't understand. Yes. How many times do we use Google Maps or use mm-hmm. an app near me, Swarm, Foursquare? Um, you, know, uh, it, it, you know, your browser is location aware as well on a mobile device. Absolutely. All of these things are getting more and more prominent, and it's enabling marketers to actually, hey, if you're driving by, maybe they ping you, you know, and say, hey. Isn't that the most natural I, em- environment right I there? I was in Florida, know? and I went to the Verizon store. I parked my car outside the store. I have the Verizon mobile app on yep, my phone. Yep, yep, yep. Parked my car outside the door, and it popped up and said, do you want to check in? In, in my car. I oh, never wow. got to the front door yet, and wow. I was totally impressed. And it was because I had their app. Yep. Um, proximity awareness is taking off. So beacons are basically these little devices, and they're very inexpensive that mm-hmm. retail stores can. So they know where you are at in their store, and they can feed you messages and, and everything depending on where you're at. Just think the whenever the beacons are actually tied to the products in those stores. And it's getting there, yeah. yeah. Wearable integration, right? Now we have, you know, all Apple Watch is coming out soon. I ain't going to do it. I'm doing it. I'm, ah. I'm totally doing it. Are you kidding me? Um, <laughs> but, but uh, you know, now now you're going to have wearable devices that are integrated through your mobile device. Yep. And they're going to be capturing data from your body, from, you know, from your surroundings, from visually, you know, everything. So yep. it's going crazy my my mom my mom's like the bionic woman she's got a a back stimulator and and she's got a heart monitor and everything else and don't don't uh, tell me there's an app for that now well they're getting there (laughs) oh my god they're getting there right now she has this device that she has to walk up to but eventually it'll be on her mobile device absolutely um her security system on her house yep has a cell phone connection on it so that if power goes out and everything else, and heating and everything everything goes through mobile, you know, um, nest nest is a great, great uh, thing. Yeah, absolutely. Remote and desktop integration. People don't realize this, but now if you're on iOS and you have, uh, you know, a Mac, um, now when my phone rings, it pops up on my desktop and I can answer it or decline it right there. Uh, I can control my, my presentations from my mm-hmm. iPhone. Mm-hmm. I can control my Apple TV from my iPhone. The integration is getting a lot tighter there. Yeah, it really is. Uh, and then, of course, mobile entertainment is skyrocketing. So um, people have their entertainment systems now. I do on yep. my mobile device, so yep. I take it with me. Podcasts are exploding in growth. Uh, read Edison Research for mm-hmm, that. Mm-hmm. Um, he's really keeping on track of that. And guess what's coming next? Auto integration. Yep. So your mobile device will be the centerpiece of your automobile uh, integration. You're gonna. Apple has a has basically a car, you know, radio that's coming yep. out that has apps and everything else. But it's gonna have seamless integration. Nothing with distracting your there device. from the road. <laughs> <laughs> but it'll all be seamlessly integrated Absolutely. with your mobile device. So those are all ways that currently we're interacting right now with mobile devices so that's the thing business owners i mean you know you're in this market as a consumer you know you're i mean with 146 million smartphones you know what you do in your own space 
why aren't you doing it for your own company and yes. actually broadcasting yeah. into the marketing space? Absolutely. Well, thank you, Doug, for, yep. mar- uh, for Marketing Tech Blog. How, they, how can they find you? Marketingtechblog.com. Absolutely. It's a great resource for all levels of knowledge into the digital marketing, marketing space and marketing technology space. So that was a great run through of a lot of mobile technology. Thank you so much. All right. Are you subscribed?